First, Paul reminds us of our dilemma apart from a personal relationship with Jesus. He says to us, remember first that you are spiritually dead without the gift of Jesus. He says here in verse 1, as for you, you were dead in your transgressions and sin. So you see, we are not in danger of spiritual death. We are not half dead spiritually. Paul says we are actually dead, flatlined. To quote John Piper again, he says, we're not, it's not like we're in the doghouse. It's more like we're in the morgue. In the doghouse, we can whimper, we can say we're sorry, we can cry out for God's mercy. However, when you're in the morgue, there is nothing you can do. And that is the human condition. Every one of us is completely dead, completely separated, completely detached from God because of the sin nature that exists within us. What does that mean? What does it mean to be lifeless in our sinful condition? Well, a spiritually dead life means that you and I are enslaved. And Paul is saying that before we had this personal relationship with Jesus, our lives were under the control of a force that's called sin. 